Hey guys, welcome back to some more XCOM. We have uh, Alien and Terror Attack in Marcel. Very difficult mission. But we have a really cool team of everybody. These missions seem to be getting shorter. Like that last one, despite being fairly difficult, was actually 13 minutes. Strike so. one. Prepare for landing. Let's see how this one fares. Oh, you already France know. France is sending an urgent mission request. Oh, it is in France. I was right. <laughs> And we've actually done this map before, I, I do recognize this one. So terror missions could have anything, and possibly very risky, but you know, we're, we're mostly here to just level up some uh, people, so we can actually do the final mission, because I'm not going in with the, uh, you know, at least my sniper needs double tap. Central, this is Big Sky. Confirm signal uplink. Strike team is in position near the terror site. Awaiting confirmation. Solid copy, Big Sky. Strike one has been given the green light. Your highest priority is to protect those civilians. Alright, let's see if I can actually throw this on top here now. Yeah, that looks like it's going to be thrown on top. There you go. No way that he can fuck that up. So, we'll see if we have to, like, RPG the top there. Wow, that's a really cool... Well, looks like nobody's there. Or is that not actually... Yeah, uh, it, we get sight there. So, they're not actually carrying. Let's uh, get some guys over here. Uh, Mr. Colin, I'm sure we'll be a fine. We just need to bring everybody here to cover. Now, I saw that disabling shot, which I've never used. And I mostly would use that to, to capture someone, which I never did use it. Uh, oh, well, looks like we have activity there. Um, I, would, I would mostly use that kind of, like... Disabling shot to either capture something or, um, I don't even know. Oh, here we go. Chrysalids! <laughs> that must be the luckiest woman on Earth. We came just in time. Alright. Well then, we do up to 8 damage, we do, we would do the full damage. Uh, okay. Well, here's what I say to you. Griffith has a really good chance to hit, so I'll take it. Wow. He just wrecked that. Alright, uh, here's what we're gonna do. Very move her back. Because we don't get sight on anyone else, so... I mean, the minute they come out to say hello, because they are Malay people, uh, we're just gonna say hi and... Oh, well, she's dead now. I guess not lucky woman, luckiest woman on Earth anymore. Oh, it's a miss. That's, that's good, because it's just saying. I would actually prefer if one of my other, uh... People gets uh, I see Mr. Colon and Griffith now get their shot, and she should actually hit him. She should have no trouble with this. Yeah, there you go. Now I saw some uh, some floaters up there actually. All right, what are you doing? Or, do we activate them? I don't even fucking know at this point. Alright, well, it's up to Griffith, though, to, uh... He has heat ammo, he should... Well, actually, maybe not. I'll, we'll, we'll take them out with my two heavies, just because it's, uh, easy two kills. These we could ask for, and there was, like, a human there, so I want to be kind of careful. You know, I don't think I've ever missed a rocket. Famous last words. Holy shit, we just blew a hole in the side of that. Well, if they weren't activated before, they are now. Oh god damn it, we can't actually see them anymore. Why is that? Well, there's was the easy solution to that one. So what the Oh what? Well how can we see them now? <laughs> Just want to make sure I was shooting the right place, but okay. Alright, and uh Griffith, you uh you just bring out your RPG and aim very carefully because I do see there's a person right there. We don't want to kill him. And he, he'll, he'll just nab two kills, like, just like that. There you go. And no upgrade for him. Alright, let's see if uh, anyone comes out. That isn't a zombie. Alright, here we go. We don't even know what it is. Could be a zombie. I don't know. Crystal it. 
Come on. Oh, Mr. Clone, come on. Today you get your upgrade. Daddy needs his upgrades. Come on. Oh, sweet. Alright, well, now we need to kind of go rush over there and help. I, I think they're heading inside? I don't really know. Alright, well, how far can you go? I, I really wish you gave me, like, a little bit of an indicator. Here we are. Uh, maybe we could go right here. Uh, oh, here we go. Oh, God, zombie. We can't actually get a shot on him, but he's actually, um... I know you may think famous last words, but he's really quite too far. Like, everyone can fucking get him. Like, he'll, he'll just kind of, like, it's, it's, a, it's a bloody zombie with, like, 10 HP. I mean, th this this sort of mission was difficult uh, the first time. Like, holy shit. Oh, fuck that wall. And both my snipers are on Overwatch right now, so if he gets that, if he really does break through this line, which he appears to be doing right now, <laughs> some guys like zombie, fuck that, <laughs> breaks the window. You know, you laugh, but that's probably how I'd be in the zombie apocalypse. All right, uh, let's see. We have Mind Fray to use on him. Oh, but he has no actual will. Um. I really want MQ to do it. Wait, who, who else are we seeing? Oh, it's just a, one of those disc things. Alright. Well, you go just hop on over here. 96! You've never had a better opportunity. Oh, dude, that was a headshot. Good job. Uh, let's see. Well, this guy, this kid's gonna die, but here's what I'm actually thinking of doing. Watch this. Okay, so, we cloak. Because she's she still needs an upgrade. She's not in a position to help at all. We bring her here. He can run away, and we save his city. What do we have? Oh, fuck, that's a sectopod. There's a cyber disc right there. All that is nothing we want to see today. Oh boy, uh, we can start to get our move our guy, gentleman up here. I'm actually surprised we can see all of this. All right, I want to move my sniper actually up there. He's not very useful to me here, so, and that's what I mean. You know, I I don't think Archangel with my armor would be clearly nearly as useful as this. Like I get an angle here. Like in doorways and stuff. Like how often do you get doorways, to be honest? And they're about to get tri they're about to get triggered. Now a sectopod seems like a rather odd thing to bring for a a mission with uh Alright, oh fuck, we can't see him. Okay, we can shoot him. Which one's my uh, my support with the grenade? Okay, I could move up here, grenade him, but that that would mean how far is my grenade? That is far away. I can move here, possibly grenade them. I take out two of them, weaken the other one. Going here would also do that, but it's half cover. How far am I really? You know, I I think I'd be close enough if I made it here. Sectopod's gonna be pissed off, I know, but I'm behind full cover at this point. Oh, yep, we're just in range. Five damage? I thought they did like ten. Oh, no, that was the, the heavies do that. Alright, well, now with that done, we have that or that guy. Now, I really want a 100% chance to crit, so this is what I do. Cloak. 100% chance to critical. Great shot. Alright, well, that's that was gonna work. Uh, we have... We have a shredder rocket and another rocket at our disposal. 
I kind of want to just kill this guy, so let's, let's just go do that. I was just hoping I'd be able to take him out, but now that he's kind of activated. I curved the bullet. Alright, and then we, uh, the last one right here. I mean, he's taking, like, a lot more damage, like, 33% extra damage or something. This should finish him off, shouldn't it? And Mike Lamb was right, once again. Roll the save. Probably should have let the, well, actually, the Shredder Rocket guy went to have done it anyways. Oh, Alright. Well, let's see what we've got. We got a shot on him. I'm actually not inclined to do anything, because I'm just going to let my, my, one of my guys kill him. Oh, hi, Chrysalids. <laughs> He's going to overwatch. How did you activate? Aha! <laughs> oh, he's dead. Oh, and my sniper even gets a shot off. It's moments like these in, in XCOM that you treasure. And a car exploded. Another car exploded. Michael Bay. Alright, well, let's see what we've got. Um, triple Strike has, has a potential shot. Not a very good chance to hit. If he moves up, he can probably get... Oh, he's on Overwatch. I just realized this. I just as I made my move. No, oh, someone took a hit damage in my team. Well, now you die. Oh, well, not really. Alright, well, um... Let's see if my sniper gets a, gets a shot off today. Probably didn't need to, uh... Oh, now there's just a chrysalid over in the back there somewhere. And where is, uh... Where's my other medic? Uh, there you are. Get over here and say hello. Might as well. She, she, she's not really nearly as much up, upgraded. What? Oh, because tri Triple Strike was up there. Once again, I confuse Mkuta with Triple Strike. I, I seem to be doing this a lot, and I apologize greatly. Alright, let's go just move my sniper up. And now we'll just go over what there. We did see a chrysalid, and there you go. He's gonna come through the door. I, I don't even understand how we can see him right now, but he's, he's dead. Now we got the little slide of outside the map. The operation was a success. Oh, we got good on the civilian saved. Probably could have gone better, but nobody died, and that's what's important. This is like the longest uh, going back to base thing we've ever had. Uh, I'm glad to see our troops aren't hesitating to wipe out the aliens. I guess I shouldn't have expected any mercy. <laughs> and we got our deep pockets upgrade, which means we got one more uh, level to do with him, Kido, which is surprising because I didn't actually think I killed anything with him of any great value, but okay. And in we have once again in the zone or double tap. It's always double tap for me. Love that double tap ability. All right, and so we're actually pretty good here. I'm I'm pretty happy with us. Um, I don't think I'd change anything here, to be honest. So. We're good. Panic has decreased across be Europe. In touch, Commander. And I guess we just uh, continue to scan for activity because I have nothing else. And they want some weapon fragments. I have lots of weapon fragments. Might as well give it to them. It's not like I need money, but it's not like I need weapon fragments either. Commander, we've got another transmission coming in from the Council. They've discovered an alien plot to disrupt. Uh, transit, so, so whatever, fuck it, yeah, montage. Endless matter with discretion.
Well, that was a simple mission. We're certainly not leaving any question as to our ability to fight the alien threat. Excellent work all around, Commander. I tried to give these guys as many kills as possible. So, Rocketeer Mayhem. Uh, I think I'll take Mayhem since he already has a uh, Shredder rocket. Yeah, uh, I think I think people are right. You know, it's better than having two rockets because you already have two rockets. It's weaker, the weaker blast rays, but the blast rays is already huge. So yeah, mayhem. Because because uh, shredder rocket is an area of effectability. So even though I can't suppress, you know, suppression is still nice. Maybe maybe I'll put suppression on my supports in future playthroughs instead, because that would be more of a support thing, you know, to keep them down, pinned down, and they can't aim. That's what I'm thinking. All right, so remember, got our panic reduction. We'll be watching. And guess what? This is the first laboratory I've ever built in Epscom. Oh wow! See, I even got an achievement for it. Oh my God! It's a laboratory which we never really need. They are not. They are so useless because I did all the research fine. Laboratory online. Like, cause I would research stuff and I would research stuff faster than I could actually produce it. So, whatever. Well, that's um interesting shit. And spin the globe round and round. Where does it land? Nobody quite knows. Detected. You know, they don't seem to actually uh, fly around my uh, base anymore. And it's a crew size of 15. So this one we should definitely, definitely be able to wrap up uh, this before we do the final mission. Or at least I'm thinking so, because uh, the only person who has a uh, level up to left to do is uh, MQDO, so... Um, uh, before I forget, he had a frag grenade on him, which I actually didn't want. Uh, so we're gonna give him a healing grenade instead, and that's what he's gonna come equipped with. I, I really like this setup. This stuff's really cool. But uh, you know, that's for next time. Because remember, we will be watching. <laughs>